uh, Gigadra, uh, what do you think on Sensor 2? What do you think about banking? Um, we need more decentralized banks. In, in Canada, we have, what do we got? Main banks we got. We got, uh, what do you call it? Um, uh, the credit unions, right? We have credit unions. Um, but So two main types of banking. There's credit unions and there's banks. But the number of banks we have is very limited. It's very centralized in Canada. And HSBC, RBC just bought HSBC, right? So one less big bank in Canada. So once you centralize all of banking, then the government can control all of it, right? The banks and the governments, they work together and screw people over. Canadian banks, top banks, froze people's bank accounts. TD Bank did, right? So banking, in my, uh, in my opinion, should go down to what it was many, 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 many decades ago, which is small local community banks that lend out money, right? for projects that are going to help the community, right? So credit unions, but even on a smaller scale, the credit unions, right? Some of them may fail, but it's not gonna take down the whole country. Right now, uh, most countries in the Western world are controlled by the banking system, right? That means we who live in the Western world are serfs to the banking system. And as Smedley Butler would say, all wars are bankers wars. Because what happens when there's hiccups in the economy, when the banks have lend out money to places that they know they're not going to get the money back, or when the country is completely indebted and has to pay interest on uh, bonds that they sold to other countries, right? In form of collateral, you get interest back, invest in us. Is your point not pointing right? Then what these bankers end up doing saying, well, we need a reset. One of the best ways to reset is start wars. And they start wars and they siphon more money, launder more money, write things off, accounting magic, right? So we need to decentralize banking. Cryptos is one way to decentralize banking. Uh, precious metals is another way to decentralize banking, decentralize commerce, decentralize finance but we need more banks we need more forms freer forms of exchanging trade currency that's what we need